Hello grade 8 learners and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I hope na napanood nyo na yung video ko regarding uh, graphing linear inequality kung hindi pa paki-check out doon sa ating playlist ng grade 8 or hanapin mo doon sa aking video sa ating YouTube channel. So for, uh, kung bago ka pa lang sa channel ko, I welcome ka. So don't forget to subscribe at hit mo na yung post notification bell para updated ka every time na mag-post ako ng bagong video lesson. So ngayon ay i-continue na natin yung ating video lesson tungkol sa pagdetermine whether ito bang mga ordered pairs na given na to ay solution nitong linear inequality. So, it's just like choosing alin sa mga ordered pairs na to ang magsasatisfy dito sa linear inequality. Para siyang test point na ginagawa natin. Again, itedetermine lang natin with whether these ordered pairs is a solution or not. Okay, so let's start. So, is 0 for a solution of y is less than x plus 3? Again, ang ating given linear inequality ay y is less than x plus 3. So, we just substitute. So, this is your x and this is your y. So, you have here y is less than x plus 3. So, your y is 4 is less than 0 plus 3. And then, 4 is 4 less than 3. So, therefore, 0, 4 is not a solution. So, as easy as that. So, are you following? So, very good. Next, y is less than x plus 3. So, this is your x and this is your y. So, your y is negative 2 is less than your x is 3 plus 3. So, negative 2 is less than 3 plus 3. So, you have here 6. Is negative 2 less than 6? So, therefore, it is a solution. So, for our last given ordered pair, so you have here y is less than x plus 3. So, this is your x and this is your y. Your y is negative 5 is less than negative 5 plus 3. So, you have here negative 5. Unlike sign, subtract, then copy the uh, copy the sign of the highest absolute value, which is yung 5. So, 5 minus 3, 2. Ang gagamitin natin symbol ay negative. Is negative 5 less than negative 2? That is correct. So, meaning to say that 3 and negative 2 and negative 5 and negative 5 are solution of y is less than x plus 3. So, marami pa mga ordered pairs that will satisfy the given uh, inequality. Pero, meron lang tayong given na ine-evaluate para i-determine alin ba dito sa tatlo ang solution. And we found out na itong dalawang to ay solution. Okay, so let's proceed to our another example. So we have here 3x plus y is greater than 10. Again, we are going to determine whether 1, 9, 5, negative 2, and negative 2, 16 is a solution or not in a given inequality. So let us start substituting. So this is your x. So this is your x and this is your y. So, given 3x plus y is greater than 10. So, 3, your x is 1, plus 9 is greater than 10. 3 times 1 is 3, plus 9, you have here 12. Is greater than 10. Is 12 greater than 10? Of course. So, meaning to say that it is a solution. Another. This is your x and this is your y. So, 3x plus y is greater than 10. So, 3, your x is 5, plus your y is negative 2. So, minus 2. Or, we can write it as plus negative 2. Para hindi malito. So, greater than 10. So, that is 3 times 5 is 15. Positive times negative is negative. So, that is minus 2. 
greater than 10. So, 15 minus 2 is 13 is greater than 10. Is 13 greater than 10? Yes. So, meaning to say that 5 and negative 2 is a solution of the given inequality. Okay, for the last one that we have, so you have your negative 2 and 16, so this is your x. And this is your y. So you have here 3x plus y is greater than 10. So 3, your x is negative 2 plus 16 is greater than 10. So 3, my, 3 times negative 2 is negative 6 plus 16 is greater than 10. So, negative 6 plus 16, or 16 minus 6, is 10 greater than 10. Is 10 greater than 10? Of course not, because equal silang dalawa. So, meaning to say that it is not a solution. So, among the given three ordered pairs, the solution are 1, 9, and 5, and negative 2. Okay, so for our last two examples, so we will be doing the same process lang. So we have here our given linear inequality which is 2x is greater than or equal to, is less than or equal to y plus 2. And then these are the order pairs that we are going to choose kung alin ba yung makakasatisfy dito sa linear inequality. So let us start. So 2, 3. Is 2, 3 a solution? So we need to find the solution for that. So this is your x and this is your y. So, 2x is less than or equal to y plus 2. So, 2, your x is 2, is less than or equal to y is 3 plus 2. So, 2 times 2, you have here 4, is less than or equal to 3 plus 2, 5. So, 4 is 4 less than or equal to 5? Yes. Next, 1, 0. Is 1, 0 a solution or not? So, let's find out. So, this is your x and this is your y. So, you have here 2x is less than or equal to y plus 2. So, 2, your x is positive 1, is less than or equal to 0 plus 2. 2 times 1 is 2 is greater than or equal to 0 plus 2 is 2. Is 2 greater than or equal to 2? Yes, kasi meron tayo dito or equal to. So, meaning to say that 1 is 0 is also a solution. For the last one, we have here 2x is less than or equal to y plus 2. 2, your x is 1 half, is, greater, is less than or equal to negative 2 plus 2. 2 of 1 half, or 2 times 1 is 2 divided by 2 is 1. Or kalahati ng 2 is 1. And then, is less than or equal to negative 2 plus 2 or 2 minus 2 is 0. Is 1 less than or equal to 0? Of course, not. So, may na to say, 2, 3, and 1, 0 are solution. Okay, for the last example that we have, so we have here y is greater than or equal to 2x. So, this your x, this your y. Your y is 0, baka, mag, baka magkabaliktad, is greater than or equal to 2 times 2. 0 is greater than or equal to 4. Of course, not. So, therefore, it is not a solution. So, negative 8 and negative 4. So, this is your x and this is your y. So, y is greater than or equal to 2x. So, your y is negative 4. And then, greater than or equal to 2 times negative 8. So, you have here negative 4 is greater than or equal to 2 times negative 8, you have here negative 16. Is negative 4 greater than or equal to negative 16? 
Yes, so mas mataas yung negative 4 sa negative 16. So for our last ordered pair, you have here 3 negative 3. So this is your x and this is your y. So y equals, y is greater than or equal to 2x. y is negative 3. Greater than or equal to 2 times 3. Negative 3 is greater than or equal to 6. Is negative 3 greater than or equal to 6? Okay, so that is not a solution. So, we need to say that negative y and negative 4 is only among these 3. So, ito lang yung solution ng y is greater than or equal to 2x. So, that concludes our lesson in determining whether the given order pair is a solution or not of the given inequality. So, you just substitute the values of x and y. Kapag siya ay true statement, so we need to say it is a solution. Kapag false statement, we need to say that it is not a solution. So, don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and classmates. And see you on our next video lesson. Thank you for watching.